but I wanted to share. Um, as I was, um, as I was out, well, as I wasn't, I was unresponsive and had no pulse on. I experienced um, going to heaven, and I wanted to tell everyone how to know how much God is so real. Um, so I was going, I was going to heaven, and it was a big city. There was a city there, and it was a tunnel. There was a, there was a tunnel, and there was, there was. Um, Sorry, I'm getting a little emotional, but there was a tunnel and it was bright and I got to see um, Jesus that I was getting ready to enter into the gates, the golden pearly gates of heaven. And there was, there was a big city, so big, you couldn't even imagine, I can't even explain, it was so beautiful and, you know, um, I seen Jesus, and I, I got to see his hand, and he put his hand up, and he had a hole in his hand from being nailed on the cross, and he told me, he said, it's not your time, he said, I'm going to send you back, and um, I was standing there like in this, I was standing there, and he was telling me he was going to send me back. And he had his hand up like this, and I could see a hole through it. And he he pushed me back like like this. And as soon as I come back to Earth, the EMT, he was doing CPR, and I just gasped for air. And I was in the ambulance, and I seen um, some angels. Like It was like they were in the ambulance. They were helping helping the EMTs, uh, like, instruct them. There was, like, three couple angels in there, the EMT, the driver, and I believe my dad was there. But, you know, and God, he, in his word, he says that he'll give his angels charge over us. And I believe that's, you know, that's what he did that day, you know. And I'm so glad to be alive and be here for my children. I'm getting better for them and... You know, I just want to let you guys know we serve a mighty good God. And, you know, you may say whatever or don't believe me, but, you know, God, he's real. And, you know, we are living in the last the last days, I believe. You know, and I would just like everybody just, you know, call out to God. Make him your Lord and Savior, you know, because he loves you. He loves me to obviously I have a purpose still. And I it it was hard to it was hard to um you know tell my story but I need to share it about my experience because um I always pray for people if you know me, you know, I pray and I try to attend church and I we all fall short from the glory of God but you know, he forgives us, and he loves each and every one of us. And I just want to let all you guys know you're not alone. And in, in even if you feel alone, you're not. You know, you can call out to God, and he'll be there for you. He says, to whom shall ever call on the name of the Lord shall be saved. So just call out to him, ask for forgiveness, and Invite him into your life and watch him show you great and mighty things because we all have a calling on our lives. But I'm just still here getting better and, you know, I, I'm i glad that I didn't think I would have some, some people to check it out, but... You know, I, I, that, was, that was my experience with God. You know, I got to see Him. And I, I want to share more, but right now I'm just breaking up, like emotional. And But thanks for watching, and you guys have a good day.